And you guys, I finally found the trick to hide in those over bleach knots, hide in the grids on your lace, and it does not include any foundation or having to use any fake scalp. And just look how natural that hairline is. And all thanks to Hair Vivi, I'm gonna put you guys on. unboxing my wig and with your wig they always send you a care package now this is what the inside of your wig looks like as you guys can see the knots are already bleached your wig does come with some combs on the inside and a non-slip elastic band attached to your wig and this elastic band does give your wig more security for a glueless install and it just basically prevents slipping now you guys if it's one thing i can guarantee when ordering a wig from here vivi is that their hairline it'll never miss they have the most realistic and natural hairlines I have ever seen or gotten my hands on on a wig. Like, they don't ever miss when it comes to the hairline. <laughs> I'm sure you guys can see what I'm talking about. Like, look how natural this looks. All right, so let me push you guys on to tea. For the girls like myself that do not like doing ball cap, fake scalp, or any of that extra stuff that is just time consuming, under all of my wigs, you can definitely find a regular wig cap just sitting on the there exactly how this one is looking right now. And you're always able to see it. On a regular day, I would just take some concealer and go back over that line. And it's usually always visible and then it's messy. Concealer usually gets on the hair and it's very hard to clean up. But thanks to Hair Vivi for now releasing their True Scalp Tape. I don't have to go through that anymore. Let me show you guys how to apply it. Their True Scalp Tape does come in two shades, which is Mocha and Cappuccino. For me, I chose Cappuccino because I felt like that one was the closest to my skin tone. And all I did was flip my wig over onto my mannequin head, remove the sticker from the package, and you want to just line it up wherever you have your wig parted. So I would suggest that you make your part in space first and then apply the tape. I also would definitely suggest placing the tape about an inch or two behind where the actual hairline starts because if you do have it too close to the hairline, you will see it and it's just not going to look good. Which, as you guys can see, I did make that mistake the first time placing it too far up in the front, but I removed it and placed it a little further back and it was good to go. Well, now that that tape is in place, the grids on my lace is well hidden and it just makes my wig looks a lot more natural and it definitely gives me like a more natural scalp result instead of having to result to using foundation or doing like a fake scalp so the true scalp tape is definitely a game changer and i just love how much more natural your wigs appear with it in comparison to using different methods that's a lot more messier and also very time consuming also, Hair Vivi does offer a multicolor HD lace, so you have two different shades to choose from, which is Mocha and Cappuccino. For myself, I did go with Cappuccino because I felt like that was closest to my skin tone. They also do carry transparent lace as well. If you really don't know which color to get and you just want to stay neutral, I would suggest it's getting transparent. But if your skin tone is somewhat similar to one of the shades that they do carry, I would suggest going with one of those. That way, you'll avoid having to put any foundation on your lace itself or having to bleach your lace. Now, before laying down my wig, I'm just cutting off all of that excess lace. Then I'm going to use my Evan Wanda Lace Bond to lay down my wig. Now I'm just taking my hot comb, making sure that my wig is completely flat on my head. And then I'm taking my curling iron, but I'm kind of using it as like a curling wand. And I'm just giving my hair some big waves. I did not leave the hair on too long because I know I didn't want it to like really look like a curl. I just kind of like wanted little waves in the hair. So I'm just using my curling iron to do that. And just on camera, you guys can see and tell the quality of this hair. Like their hair quality, guys, is so good. 
The hair is super silky, has a very nice shine to it. I did not even add any products to this hair, you guys. This is the hair in its natural state. No extra products added. The hair has like a very nice shine to it. I really like that. The hair is super soft, very silky and nice. It has a very nice luster to it. Um, The hair was really thick as well in density. I was really impressed with that. Like there was no thin ends. The hair was like full throughout the entire wig. I'm not exactly sure the name of this wig in particular, but I will have that linked down below for you guys with all the details on the hair itself because I don't have that detail in front of me right now. But just check the description box for all the info on the wig itself if you guys are interested in it. But yeah, this is pretty much the hair, you guys. So beautiful. The hair is definitely a 10 out of 10. Absolutely amazing. And what I like about their new upgraded wig construction is that you do get a bit more part in space, especially like on the sideburn areas. So you guys know how most wigs, they'll be like, it's a 13 by 6 um, lace frontal. But when it comes to like the side areas, your part in space is actually shorter than what it is in the middle. But with their new upgraded wig, you actually get a larger part in space even on the side. So I really like that. So now we're able to achieve a very deep side part, not just in the center. As you guys can see, the hairline is just amazing. Also, for some strange reason, the lace look a little orange on camera, but I promise you guys, my foundation was looking really light this day. I don't know why, but in person, it did not look so orange. It looks really good in person. So it, but to me, it was honestly like a perfect match. The hair quality is just like top of the top. You guys know this already. I love me some hair baby wig. Right now in my closet, I still have two of their wigs, still going strong till this day. The wigs are probably like, one is definitely like two and a half years old. The other one is barely new, but their wigs will definitely last you some years. So do not be scared to spend those coins on a wig from here, baby, because you're definitely getting what you're paying for and you are paying for quality, okay? This pretty much wraps up this video. I hope you guys learned something new. Definitely try that true scalp tape. It is a game changer. If I do have any additional info that will be listed down below, check out the description box for all the details on this wig. I will have it linked down below. Lashes that I'm wearing are from my collection. Also, if I do have a discount code for Hair Vivi, that will be listed down below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed already to my channel and I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye!